what I like to do is show you how to combine like terms. Um, on an expression like this, the first thing we want to do is uh, we actually can need to simplify this expression. So what we're going to do here is we're going to want to use the distributive property. And what I mean by distributive property is I send that this four outside of parentheses and this eight outside of parentheses. I'm going to need made to multiply that four and the eight into every single term. So I'm going to get a four x minus thirty six y plus a 24x plus 16y. Now I've simplified it, and what I want to do is when I combine like terms, I can only combine x's with x's, um, y's with y's. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rewrite this so that my x's are next to each other and my y's are next to each other. Therefore, now I see that 4x plus 24x, think of it as like 4 apples plus 24 apples, right? X represents something we don't know. It's actually going to, you know, usually we have to represent a number, but let's say it represented apples, you know? 4 apples plus 24 apples equals 28 apples. Negative 36 plus 16, negative 36y plus 16y is a negative 16y. Therefore, that's going to be my final answer. So that is how you combine like terms when you have using distributive property.